This whole administration has completely lost their fucking mind! And I think we're all gonna die! <laughs> So we got some more Batman part de rumors. And again, these are rumors, speculation, take with a massive grain of salt and don't believe everything that you read on Twitter. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> so here we go. The Joker will play a similar role to Hannibal Lecter and will provide information to Batman. Now we saw this in the Batman deleted scene where we saw that great back and forth with Barry Keoghan and Robert Panson. I really liked Barry's performance in that scene. He was really playing up the, the sinister nature and intelligence of the Joker, which we really don't see often. On, especially when it comes to you know theatrical films so and i love the fact that barry keoghan was playing that up and hopefully they continue that uh that uh side of joker a, a bit more for part two hopefully they also downplay the makeup because i don't like the makeup it's not scary it's not scary it just looks weird it looks dumb so hopefully you know they tone it down a bit the second part will be uh clayface will be a serial killer who uses his victim's skin to change the appearance of of his face now this is weird because this sounds a lot like hush this is something hush would do especially if you played the batman arkham city games where he would literally like stitch people's faces other people's faces onto his face you know to obviously look like that person so the fact that you know they're gonna do that with clayface uh it's a bit strange i get it it seems like they're going back to the golden age version of clayface and not the big mud monster which again i'm okay with because that iteration of clayface definitely would not work for this world that matt reeve set up because it's too out there it's too comic booky like clayface the mud monster that would work for the dcu james gun because that version and that world is gonna be much more fantastical you know rather than this zodiac killer fucking a uh, real world take on the batman so i get it here so i like that um also the final thing is there will be a, uh, more action sequences than the first movie which okay i get it because I, I know uh, especially with myself and some other people you know the one of the criticisms was it's a very slow film it's a very detective noir film which again i understand but hopefully for the sequel like like you can have both right it, it doesn't have to be one or the other like you can still have that story driven uh noir take on batman but also amp up the action a bit so you can please both sides so two things are possible at once people believe it or not so those are the rumors i like it sounds good again these are just rumors speculation but it sounds plausible like nothing that i read here sounds like out of the norm like oh that doesn't fit like that, that sounds stupid no it all sounds like yeah i, I could see matt reeves implementing these ideas uh into the into this film so hopefully that's the case because if it is then the batman part two could be an absolute banger so that's gonna be it hit like subscribe follow me on twitter Instagram, discord tiktok sis that in the comments below what do you think of these rumors do you like it do you not like it and as always truth out how about that d baby